welcome to Port Patrick. Lovely jubbly. Excited sky. I did drive up that road there to the left, it leads to a caravan site, so no, no pictures up there at all. Lovely little town. Oh, lovely nice white cottages, little roads leading off every corner. We've got the sun setting, we've got a shop there, plenty of shops here guys. Plenty of restaurants, plenty of pubs, just how we like it. Oh, look at that sunset, how glorious is that welcome. Welcoming us to Port Patrick. Here we are guys, the hard side. Lovely harbour, absolutely stunning place. Right, I think I can park up, you can't park to the right I don't believe, but uh, you can park up here. These lovely cottages here guys. Absolutely stunning. It's a bit like Portree on the Isle of Sky. The beautiful pink cottages on the seafront. But I'll spin it round and uh, you'll see what I mean. It's uh, It looks a little bit like Cornwall to me. And I think the park up, up here on the top of the top of the hill. For the moment, look at that guys. What a pretty place. What a beautiful place. A beautiful little harbour. It's got that kind of Cornish vibe about it. We'll have a look around later. We'll get settled in. We've got the sea out there. I think that's the uh, that be the uh, Irish Sea, the North Sea. Irish Sea, I think. Not the North Sea, of course. You're just Stephen, you idiot. Um, that's over to the Isle of Man, an island, I believe. What a place, what a stunning little place. Right, we'll settle in and start somewhere to get a wind of you. At Port Patrick, beautiful, absolutely stunning camp. That's my bedroom view. I'll show you that in the morning. The sleepy village down there. Beautiful. Back at you later. Good morning, good mo- on this bloody windy, howly, blowy morning. Blimey, it's been blowing the night, it's been a bit of a hurly come through. Uh, I've been up about an hour. I've had, I've been dressed and uh, had a wash, had a cup of tea, lovely, sorted sky out as well. Oh, let's get up, uh, just lying on my bed for a bit. Here we are, I've got the kettle on again. Kettle's on mother, oh, it's boiling. <laughs> There she is down there. Morning Sky. How you doing, Mucka? My little baby. It's cold out there. Baba put her out this morning and she comes straight back in. She's all, Dad, I ain't having none of that. Uh, as you can see, everything's rocking, guys. Everything's bouncing around a bit in the van. And uh, lovely job. It's just to uh, knock that kettle off, guys. Bear with. And I'll show you where I am. Kettle's on, Mother. You all right, Sky? You gonna have your breakfast, eh? You gonna eat your breakfast? No? <laughs> uh, I'll just show you my bedroom view, guys. Just go to my, right, my pit area. At the lovely Port Patrick, and I'm sat in probably the most prime position in the bay. Absolutely beautiful. And Sue's on the way out now. Colored cottages, got a the lighthouse there as well. Uh, there's walks, there's castles, there's churches, there's all sorts of guys, lovely pubs, restaurants, shops, uh, somewhere to get some water. Uh, a local did tell me it's okay to park here, even though it says no overnights. I was here last night, nobody bothered me. I was the only one on here. You can see that sea roaring in, or oh, it's roaring in it at the moment. But uh, what a stunning place, eh? What an absolutely beautiful place. If it calms down later, we'll go out for a meander. I might treat myself to something to eat, thanks to you guys over there. And get Sky a treat as well with your lovely treats, donations. Lovely guys, thank you. Got a big uh, hotel on top of the hill there, on top of the cliffs. Uh, There's quite a bit to see here, so I'll probably stay for a few days. Lovely. This massive car park here. It's quite a big car park. To say over no overnights, but uh, hey ho, lovely Port Patrick. Let's have a look at the front, it's even more dramatic at the front. Can I open it against the wind? Bear with me. Whoa, the wind won't let me open the bloody door. 
Right, here we go. Oh, look at that outside, Christine. Wow. What a view. Let's see it, Christine. Oh, blimey. Oh, the wind nearly got my fingers trapped in the door. That's my view out the kitchen window. Look at that. What a lovely view to cook breakfast at. The raging Irish sea is smashing up against the rocks here. Absolutely stunning. Look at that. All round vistas, guys. Ocean all around me. Lovely job, Lee. How stunning. What a place. What a place. I love it. Port Patrick. Wow, we just sat here in the uh, captain's seat. How beautiful is this? I'm just stuck. I could sit here for hours and totally memorised by the tide and the winds and this lovely, lovely port. All those raging seas all around me, all out the front as well, all around Christine. Absolutely stunning. Look at that, guys. All around 360 Vista. Got the sea all around, more or less. Looking back at the port. I believe that's the remains of the really old harbour wall that uh, went down in the storms a few centuries ago. Some square linear structures there. That was the old arbor wall, I believe, that uh, didn't last. Amazing. Absolutely stunning. The sun's trying to come out. It's calming down a little bit here. And the sun glistening across the Irish Sea there. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. Beautiful. So we might get a chance to get out and have a little mooch. Have a little mooch around this, this sky down there. Hey sky! She's had a bit of breakfast, uh, she went outside, she's struggled uh, going to the toilet a little bit. Uh, I think she's got a bit of an upset stomach today, but uh, she'll be alright, she's good. Oh, it's lovely out there, look, absolutely lovely. Uh, just having some afternoon porridge. Uh, today's porridge, we've got uh, fresh cream in there, guys, brown sugar, and some chocolate flakes. Lovely jubbly. That's my little treat for this morning. Sky's having a nip in the front, a little kip. Lovely. Oh, that's lovely. All I've done is uh, Arthur chocolate, you know, Cadbury's chocolate flake. Crunch one of those up. Dropped it on top of my hot porridge. Got fresh cream in there as well. Touch of brown sugar for texture. It's bloody lovely. Oh, this is divine, guys. Porridge with chocolate chips, it's bloody lovely. Van Tucker, country van life Van Tucker. I'll try anything I will. <laughs> I used to be a chef, you know. That's it, guys. Oh, uh, it's going to be pear shaped up here in Galloway. Oh, got a hooli coming in, blasting us from the Irish Sea, the North Irish Sea. Can all of it cry out there now, pelting down with rain. There's a bit of sleet in there as well, and a van starting to bounce around. As you can see, guys. All oh, good fun in van life. We love it. Van Dyle, I'm afraid, today. 
to show. Sky just went into the captain's seat in the front of the cab. And I heard crunching noise again. I thought, what has she got now? And I looked. Down at Stanra Beach, I found this lovely little oyster catcher's uh, skull head. Just the skull, you know, it rotted away like all the flesh had gone. It was a beautiful skull, lovely colour, complete as well. Lovely little uh, skull from a collection. Skies et it. She's a little monster, I tell you. <laughs> I had a little uh, spring lamb skull. I, got. I think I was on the Isle of Sky. That was a lovely thing as well on my front dash. And she hit that about three months ago. She's going to net me bloody oyster catcher's skull now. Can't keep anything with that bloody Bulgarian nut hat. I know dogs will chew bones, guys. It's probably my own fault putting them in a reach. But uh, she should know better. She's been told not to touch them. I've got other skulls and jewels on there that she don't touch. It seems to be the fresh ones that she goes for. They've probably got, still got a bit of a smell of the animal, I don't know. But what a little tinker. Catch you. I hope it calms down so I can go out tonight and have a look around the town, maybe. Hey ho, that's winter for you guys in van life. You've got to be prepared to be uh, locked up for days on end sometimes, especially in Scotland and the Hebrides. But it's still beautiful, still lovely to look at. Hey, Tom. Beautiful sunset while I'm watching England versus Scotland rugby. Come on England, come on Scotland. I don't know which one to shout for because I'm living in Scotland. <laughs> lovely job, look at that lovely sunset. It's calming down the winds a little bit now. Lovely. What a beautiful evening at this camp. They had rough weather today but the sun is settling now. The sun's setting. A lovely colour in the sky and across the Irish Sea. And here's my supper or my evening meal. Lovely job, eh? I've got some duck pancake spring rolls, which I've fried up. I've got a mixed pasta salad there, which I've sorted out. Boiled egg, a um, bit of an onion bhaji, some nice crusty tiger bread with plenty of butter. And of course, Arthur's joining me for dinner. Nice pint of Guinness on this gorgeous evening in my van life. Look at that out there, guys. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that colour of that sky. Stunning. Absolutely stunning van life. Lovely location. It's one of the lifeboats coming in to Port Patrick. It's a lovely sunny morning today. The window for you guys. We have a light boat festival here with fireworks and parties and stalls and everything. Uh, I'm not sure what time of year, but uh, hopefully it's why I'm on the, the uh, in the area in the next couple of months. Anybody know when the uh, light boat festival is at Port Patrick, guys? There we go. We'll see what Port Patrick is all about. Are you ready, Sky? Lovely job. Glad to show you the view out of Christine this morning. Uh, where are we? It's quarter past uh, 11. Uh, we've got 20 degrees inside. I think it's about uh, 8, 9 degrees outside. I'll turn you around, guys. Good walk. Beautiful. And we are just there below the rock. Lovely. What a spot. What a camp. Arcade, boardwalk, a couple of little shops and takeaways, but uh, I think they're all shot at the moment. It's pretty lovely little fishing harbour. We'll go down into the town, guys. Okay. Wow, what a 
lovely piece of uh, crafting with wood. That is stunning. That is gorgeous. Some wind chimes up there as well. What a, what a beautiful place. What a stunning building. I might buy the lighthouse. Back lighthouses don't look that old, probably Victorian, I'm not sure. Oh, oh there's plenty of wood there, Charlie. There's Christine sat on the harbour wall there. That lovely sea view. Lovely bench there. trinkets and curios and all sorts of curious things in there. So let's shut on fire. Easter Island. stuff. Hello Geezer. How you doing? All sorts of goodies in there guys. Antiques and curios, curiosities. Betty boop boop boop. Lovely. What a lovely place. Guys, Port Patrick Harbour, and it is a pretty harbour as well. Absolute, what a lovely haven for the boats! Beautiful. And up there, by the lighthouse, you can see the story of Christine. Stunning in the sunset, absolute, what a beautiful camp. Can you see it? Can you see Christine? Beautiful. Put the hotel on top of the cliff there. through the haze, just trying to adjust that uh, lighting a little bit guys and she is sat on there, sat on the point out there, beautiful. Up on top of the rocks now in the middle of the harbour, windy, there's Christine, glorious, out to the Irish Sea, oh it's windy, oh. Sky down the play, she don't want to come up here. Beautiful guys. Oh, let's get down off here. It's chilly up here. Gorgeous. That's an impressive hotel up there. 
Oh, it's on the cliff top. Have a look at this beautiful bay. Oh, but it's glorious here in the sunshine in the summer. Sitting on there with your picnics on this breaker wall. Absolutely beautiful, guys. Looking back at Port Patrick. Look at this down here, guys. Wow. This is the old harbour. Original harbour. Going back to the 1700s. Wow, how bonkers. Look at that archway. Look at that. Some sort of a... Uh, I don't know, some sort of a uh, drainage. Water system. Look at that. This is rocks I want to hear, guys. I'm very, very... Uh, very, very slippery. Like ice. can barely stand up. Then we get a slip down the foot. Quite walking on the jello. Next to fair guys. Oh it is. Oh amazing. Oh look at that archway. Very bonkers. Tell you what guys, I can barely move. Quite walking on jello. Ice and jello. Oh, it's really back side, I'm going to get closer. Oh, it's got so far away. Get off down there. Don't like to fall in that. Oh. Epic. Absolutely epic. I'll try and get over there a bit closer. Oh, absolutely stunning. Princess Victoria. Not sure what's going on here. Some sort of culvert. But, uh, that looks really old there. Wow! Whoa! Thank you. Got soaked. Let's get out of here. Oh, did a girder up or something? Wow! Oh, what a place! What a place! The other side now. That's a slippery rock I was on there. That was so slippery. Oh! Love it! Oh, what, what it would we be like in here in a storm? It would be absolutely awesome stuck in here in a storm. The raging sea belting in there. Epic, absolutely epic. Whoa! How dramatic! Look at this place! Wow! Look at this! Top of the archway there guys, walking across. A bit precarious. Especially this guy with me. I don't know if you can walk on here, but uh, hi ho. You know what I'm like guys. Oh look at this. Absolutely bonkers! What is this all about? Ah. Stood on the 
on this wall. A bit precarious. Oh. But amazing. Absolutely amazing. Get up this wall for the fall Oh! Right on top of that bridge wall. The hard way. Oh dear, oh dear. Shaking. My knees are trembling. It's bonkers. Absolutely bonkers up here. 